The anatomy of the head is something that I am really, really passionate about. I think for a long time, the head was almost seen as a separate structure to the rest of the musculoskeletal system. Uh, but the question is, where does the anatomy of the head end and the anatomy of the neck start? I think whatever we do with horses, understanding these structures are so important for musculoskeletal health and performance, for bridal fit, to help us understand way of going. We've got important structures as well as the muscles, nerves, the temporomandibular joint, the hyoid apparatus, and of course the horse's teeth. Now, dental discomfort, dental pain truly can affect performance. As we've learned from the incredible Dr. Chris Pierce at previous Horses Inside Out conferences, but I'm so pleased that this coming conference, which is all about growth and development, a journey of a lifetime, Chris is going to be looking at dental problems that often happen with young horses and can potentially affect uh, them starting out, so it's problems that can affect horses when we first start riding them. Getting the horse's dental health right from the very beginning is so important. And this is relevant to all riders, whatever discipline, as well as equestrian professionals. So I do hope that you are able to join us at the Horses Inside Out conference in February 2024. It's growth and development, a journey of a lifetime. And there's an early bird discount. So do check that out. Book on before the 31st of October to take advantage of that. I do hope to see you there.